Blaze Buddies, what is up, everybody? Well, recently, I put up a post that said, do not be afraid to travel a new path. It may be the way to find what you've been looking for all along. That quote is pretty significant is as I've, I have a new journey ahead. Eight weeks ago, or a little bit more than that, I found out that we will be closing our doors here where I've been working for the last, as of this Monday, 12 years. 12 years of coming in, getting up every morning at 4.30, getting here for, you know, in the beginning it was 5.15, eventually I gave myself some 15 minutes of extra sleep. So 5.30 in the morning, 7.30 at night, C crushing it. 12 to 15 hours a day. There were some times where, you know, I was really uh, curious if I would make it today. <laughs> you know, there's been slow times, super busy times, you know, people come, people go, but man, so much has transpired this last 12 years. I mean, I came from a facility uh, 12 years ago that I I was working really hard. I was only there for a little under four years and I really, really, really worked my tail off and, and built up a very consistent clientele. And unfortunately I had to leave. Uh, they made some changes. I didn't agree with some of the changes. So I made the decision to come here at Infinite Fitness and Personal Training in Wyndham, Massachusetts. And I just dug in. I, uh, I I worked really hard the first few years just to build up. You know, I ha was very, very blessed to have a good percentage of my clients from Andor over follow me to here. But, you know, that was, you know, maybe 10 people. And then I had to really, really bust my ass to build up the clientele to, you know, get to the point where I was working a good full time, you know, regardless if I had one person a day or I had 10 people a day, I was still here for 12, sometimes 14 hours a day. So you get what you give, as I always say. But, you know, I only have 10 minutes on here to, to talk. That's the limit, I guess. But uh, there's no way I could describe the 12 amazing years amazing in many ways and you know there were i pushed one year i pushed myself so hard i was in the process of moving working here 12 to 14 hours a day massive amounts of stress i was dieting i ended up in the hospital i put myself in the hospital rushed to the er you know, it's been crazy. I, I've lost some very, very special people in my life who are, since I've been here, I, I could, man, I could just go on. And I, I could literally stay on here for a, a month nonstop and explain each and every single client, friend, person, so on. And it wouldn't be enough. It wouldn't be enough. So I'm very, very grateful for having the opportunity to, to you know, set up in here, you know, in my little cave in this office. You can't really see it. You see me on here, you know, from time to time on these videos. But I'm in a little tiny closet of an office. I come in every morning and I just prep for my the clients ahead for the day and uh i go out there and on that floor and i push it as hard as i can i've tried my best to get everybody to their best so you know it's a very scary thing and like in the quote it says you know don't be afraid to travel a new path well i've i've in the last 25 30 years i've been 
I've had to, I've had to restart from scratch like three times now, three major times. You know, when I left the the Andover facility twelve years ago, I was scared coming here. I I was scared, you know. When I when I left, when I left, going as far back as fifteen years ago, when when I was at I was general managing a gym in Methuen, Mass and doing personal training, and contest prepping people, and all that, and I left, that that dynamic was a big health club facility, and I was doing my personal training early morning till noon, I was starting work at around one, and then, you know, it's it was a different dynamic. Then when I left there, and I went to the Endover place for four years, it was straight out personal training. It was still a major health club, but it was a very small facility. And I, I would, man, I, I was fired up to go full time. Now, now, since I've been here, it's been, I've been given all I have. Every ounce of energy in me to the point where I actually, again, I literally put myself in the hospital. You know, there's been some really amazing time highlights that I could go into. I did one more con bodybuilding contest at the age of 51. Uh, you know, again, I lost some very special people in my life. Uh, some clients, a very close couple of close friends. You know, I consider all my friends family. You know, so uh, man, so now I, I now a new path is ahead of me. Next Thursday is my last day here, Christmas Eve. And the following week, I start a new journey, a new path. And in, as in the quote says, it says, it may, be what, it may be the way to find what you've been looking for all along, but I'm always looking for the same thing. I'm always looking to do my best, get, get everybody to their best, put them before myself unselfishly and and that's the fulfillment you know people get into personal training they think they're gonna make a lot of money i know way make a lot of money i some weeks don't even have enough to pay my bills but what i do get back from that is seeing people realize their greatness Get them to see inside what they can do, what they're capable of. Show them that they can do it, no matter what their damn age is. I've had people as young as 10 years old here. I've had, I have a woman who's 80. I have a, several women in their mid-70s. Anything is possible. So, next Week will be that it that's it for here, and I'm very, very sad. I'm very, very sad. I'm very scared, and I'm very excited at the same time because the following week I'll be, I'll be, I already have my command center set up over there at Salem Athletic Club, and I'm gonna go in there and I'm gonna do the absolute best I possibly can, and then some. And I, I hope and I, I'm very appreciative to uh, the owner as to letting me be part of the team over there. And I'm going to I'm going to I'm not going to let him down. And more importantly, I'm not going to let myself down. And I'm definitely not going to let the clients down. So if you graced me with your with your trust in this last 12 years, I want to say thank you. And uh, I hope that you maybe will contact me at some point over in Salem and maybe we can get things rocking again, all right? So thank you again. I love you all. Have an amazing holiday. I'll talk to you very soon. And get to the gym even more so now in 2021. All right, take care, everyone.